while Sandy we they're looking at the beautiful and charming forest, the lovely hills, the various species of forest life, the Gopis, enjoying the natural scenery which the Lord himself has created. He will approach a deserted ashram and the Sri Ram will ask of the great sage, O oh, Ram and Lakshman, this was the ashram of the great sage. The great sage uh, Gautam Rishi and his Dharam Patni Ahilya. And with hands clasped, he prostrates unto the feet of the Lord. Oh Prabhu, how blessed am I to have this privilege to see with these two physical eyes. What blessing have I gotten from thousands of births before? And she praised the Lord in ways more than one. Constantly devotees bowing unto the feet of the Lord, revering those lotus-like feet. Those magical feet, whenever we humble to the Lord, we humble to the feet of the Lord. We let our heads go down. It signifies humility and prostrating again and again. Sri Ram asked her to be lifted. And as she got up, Bhagavan places blessed hand upon her head, blessing her devotees, having relieved her from that state, that state of the stone statue. And the Lord having redeemed her, now moves on further, devotees with sage Vishwa Mitra. Ayodhya Bhati Ram Chandra Ki. 